Getting stuck on the same weight for an extended period of time is completely normal and happens to almost everyone. So you don't need to be worried because I'm gonna tell you how to easily fix this issue. But before you get to destroying your plateaus, you need to find the reason why you're stuck in the first place. This can vary based on your current situation. So let me show you the most common situations where people encounter plateaus. And I'm 100% sure that one of those situations is your exact case. The first situation is that you are on a diet. A lot of people might not know this, but when you are on a diet and you lose a lot of weight, you are almost guaranteed to hit a plateau, or even worse, get weaker. It's very hard to get stronger when you are in a big calorie deficit. Because as we all know, the more you weigh, the more you can lift. That's why we have weight classes in sports. Where this matters when you are on a diet, even just maintaining your current strength level will be a very big achievement. So don't view plateau on a diet as a bad thing. It's something to be expected, and it's still better than getting even weaker when you think about it more. It's not even a plateau because you weigh less and less every week. So it becomes harder and harder for you to push the weight, which means that you are basically still progressing, even if it might not look like it. At the first glance, a very similar situation can occur when your body weight keeps on being the exact same month after month if your body weight is the exact same as it was a year ago. No wonder you are hitting plateaus all over the place. It's a very clear sign that you are doing something wrong to be exact. You are not giving your body enough nutrients to grow and it's very hard to get stronger when you are still stuck on the same body weight. So give your body an opportunity to get bigger and introduce a calorie surplus. Even a very small surplus of like 200 extra calories per day will result in you getting way bigger over time. These were the situations where the reason for your plateau was most definitely caused by your diet. But you can get yourself stuck for a multum of other reasons. Like for example, using the same exercise variation over and over. Imagine this, you have been going to the gym for two years and for the whole time you have been using the same exact exercises. If this is your case and you are stuck on certain weight, then you really need to reconsider your exercise selection. Don't worry, it's not anything complicated if you, for example, did only the barbell bench press for the last two years straight. All you need to do is change the variation a little bit, so ditch the barbell and try the dumbbell bench press instead or try pressing in the Smith machine. You can pretty much replace it with any another chest pressing exercise. It's just all about finding a new and fresh variation. This by itself can be enough to break through a plateau, just switch to another variation of the exercise for a couple of months, and then you can come back to the exercise you did originally, and you will completely blast through the weight that you were previously stuck on. What you can also do if you don't want to switch the exercise variation is to completely change the rep wrench that you are working in. You can also change the IR wrench together with changing the exercise variation but that's up to you. It's pretty much the same situation as we using the same exact exercises for very long periods of time. Your body will simply get used to what you're doing because it's the same exact thing over and over. You simply can't expect to continuously make gains when you're using the same exact rep wrench for two years straight. So let's go back to the bench press example if you have been using the five to eight rep or wrench for a very long time. For example, then try switching to a higher one like eight to 12 or 12 to 15. Of course, you will have to drop down and wait a little, little bit, but something as little as changing the rep branch can play a huge role in helping you break through plateaus, so to absolutely simplify it. The main key to breaking a plateau is to change what you have been previously doing to give your body something new to work with, but if you have been consistently offering your body some variance and you are still plateauing, it might be time to do a D-low or just straight up take a week of going to the gym. DLO means that you take your normal training plan that you do every week and you cut everything in it in half, which mainly means the amount of weight that you use and the number of workouts. So for example, if you are normally going to the gym six times per week, you will go just three times instead. And if you normally bench 200 pounds, for example, use just a half of that, the DLO workouts are going to be pretty easy, but you will be really surprised how effective it can be in terms of completely refreshing your body and mind because your body might be just completely fried from you, trying to push it to its absolute limits every week. So then you can come back to the gym and blast through your previous plateaus. Lucky you were never even stuck before. If you're looking for an easy to follow training or nutrition plan, then go to bodybuildingsimplified.svg.